I was in college, uh, I, my parents gave me the speech because I was in a sports team. Good morning, Steam Tournament number four for Western Bass Club, Lake Washington, September 14th, I think it is. Uh, Two-day tournament, weather today seems pretty decent. Um, got about 12, 13 boats out there. Should be a fun tournament here and hopefully the fish cooperates, that's all that matters. Uh, currently I'm sitting in fourth place in Angler of the Year. But we got some pretty darn good sticks uh, fishing here today. So uh, I'm going to come out here and just have some fun. That's really all it's about. So. Down with the big fish coming to the scale. 3.46, 3 3.46. Woo! I don't know, let's see. Woohoo, Noah! Four. Four eight, four point four eight. Oh. Little small mouth. A bigger horse mouth here. So after day one. I don't even know what place I'm in. I have like nine and a half pounds. Um, Search for largemouth for probably most of the day actually, or at least half of the day and caught quite a bit, but uh, they're all small. I was able to weigh three of them in. The last one that came up, hit my lure and spit it out so fast I wasn't able to set the hook. It was probably a five pounder. Then a couple few other docks later, it was like another three pounder that came out of the dock and didn't hit it, but at least I know them there, they're there. So maybe tomorrow I'll go back out there and see if I can hook into a, a better quality fish and uh, luckily towards the end I came in with another two pounder um, otherwise it would have been a really tough day so I'm probably in the middle of the pack again and again tomorrow hopefully the weather holds up it's supposed to be raining quite a bit tomorrow and uh, but yeah uh, Kai who lives on the lake here but really good fisherman uh, knows this lake uh, quite a bit and he's in the lead now with like 18 pounds or something just annihilating the field so as expected. Um, so anyway, tomorrow will be a better day, hopefully. Hopefully I can come in with a decent bag. Um, so we'll see. Good morning, day two. I'm about to head up to Newport to meet up with the rest of the guys. Uh, I'm currently sitting in sixth place. Have no chance of winning this probably. Um, so I'm gonna go for probably a big fish or hopefully, or just kind of think around a little bit and run around and do what I do. Um, it's raining, sprinkling actually a little bit now, which is fine. I'd rather fish in this than in the freaking wind like yesterday. Um, I don't have any grass because somehow getting pounded uh, from the waves yesterday, um, it turned off and couldn't figure out uh, why um, it's not working. So looked at it yesterday. So anyway, um, who knows? I might just be fishing for largemouth all day and learn something new. And this is what it's all about. It's just going out here and you know see what uh see what's out there and explore a little bit and uh maybe come in with a, something decent better than yesterday so anyway i'll see you later Just to give you an idea of the conditions that's out here, and thank goodness I got a 52 inch shaft now, uh, trolling motor. But you can see right uh, 
south of 520 here, and it's freaking rough. So, uh, yeah, this is brutal. And look at this shit. Oh my gosh. I'm underneath I 90 here. So it was calm earlier just to get away from stuff, and then all of a sudden, this damn thing just came through here and blasted us right now. I've ever fished in these uh, type of conditions before. Got a half ounce weight, and I still my line still bold, and I'm just basically testing this drop shot of line here. Again, I came down to I-90 here just to get protected a little bit. It was calm earlier, but I swear, just to just came through. This is freaking nasty. Thank goodness. I tell you what, I tell you what, this uh, Ultrax is a lifesaver though. Keeps me still right in my spot, even this wind here. Insane. Not quite as good as yesterday, but still pretty damn awesome. Kai 17.35, 17.3. So anyways, uh, thanks for coming. We're gonna just get right into it. Uh, it was a pretty good tournament for most people, I think. A lot of people caught fish, a lot of people caught limits. Um, so we'll just start right off. Actually, you know what, we'll do a little rundown. Start. Start with fifth. Uh, fifth says 21.17. Uh, Jason Crandall fourth. You just got shit on. Uh, 24.75. <laughs> nice. Uh, third place winner of $53.20. Brad Johnson with 27.47. Woo! <laughs> Second place, winner of $79.80, but we just rounded up to $80, or $80, is Mark Brown with 29.81. Woo-hoo! I'm back in Lake Washington, that's good. Uh, so I don't know if you guys know, ever, know him by now, but... Um, Seems to own this lake and a couple others. Kai, first place, 36.32. Nice. Uh, don't go anywhere because you also won $40 for the big fish, which was 4.55. Came in fifth place again. Uh, finished up with a 
large mouth and four small mouth. Came with 11.7 at the end. Um, did fish for small mouth early enough. I guess they were caught pretty early and didn't fish it deep enough. So uh, didn't make that adjustment quite fast enough. But overall, still got some pretty decent fish. Um, but yeah, fun year overall. Fifth place in three tournaments and I uh, ended up winning a rod, so that's pretty cool. So anyway, uh, that was it. So uh, angle of the year wise, I think I'm in like fourth, third, fourth place or something like that. So good year. I was able to fish a lot of tournaments this year and I hopefully uh, do the same next year.